So too. Uh, what's wrong with you? Where's Uncle? What's wrong? Uncle, I hear Ma's coming back. Huh? When's he arrive? Tomorrow afternoon at three. Coming by train. Is he crazy? Hasn't three years in jail been enough? Something way hates his guts. Considers him an enemy. He's the one who framed him. Do you think you'll let him come back? You'll kill him. You're right. When Ma arrives, Tsung's men will be waiting to kill him. Dad, we've got to think of something. Well, all right. Go and get all the men and bring them here. And we'll try to work something out. So he is coming back here. You remember what I said? Three years ago? Hmm. If he ever came back, you'd have him killed. Right. That bastard Ma. Always opposed me. Trying to wreck my business. It cost me a lot to have him framed. You'd think three years in jail would have taught him a lesson. Well, I'll fix him for good if he does come back. Mr. Song, what do you suggest? Take some gunmen. Wait for him at the station. When he gets out, you finish him! I know we all want to help Ma. But still, none of us here wants to die. There's gonna be a lot of some gunmen around there. Hey, listen! That's enough of that sort of talk. Hey, if you're so scared of bullets, then you stay at home. And don't go to the goddamn station. Hey? Now, come on. You're talking like a fool. Not thinking. Hey? All I'm trying to say, let's not rush in. Let's have a plan. What's wrong with that? Uh... Him? He wouldn't recognize a plan if it bit him in the leg. <laughs> <laughs> Our friend here has been around. And he knows the local scene. Let's hear what he has to say. <laughs> well, all right. Think of something. Huh? Uh. <laughs> hey, hurry up. He made a point. Now think of something. Well, come on. I think we're going to be no match for Song. <laughs> hey, now look. Your kicking technique is good. No one denies that. But even when you add that to Sao Chu's Kung Fu, it isn't enough. What do you mean? That we just have to let Bobby kill? Oh, no. But we'll have to do something special. Special? Hmm. What we must do is try to confuse Sung's men. What we need is many men. More than Sung is going to send and surround them. When they move, we'll move as well. If they pull their guns, stand in front of them. Block them. Eh? That's you. Your men will have one job. You screen Ma. As soon as he gets off the train, your men surround him. Get him from the station. Even if Sung's men try to fire at him, huh? They can't get a clear shot. All right, that's what we'll do then. Now, let's work out the details. Oh, do we take our guns there? Eh? Our shotguns are useless. And they'll have modern pistols. And the police would see our guns. Damn it. All those police are in Sung's pocket. Hey, even though we pay their salaries. And they're supposed to protect us. But Sung King Wei, he brains them. We know all that. That's nothing new. Meet at the station. Tomorrow noon. Yeah? 
Where's Big Lab then, huh? Oh, watch in the road. That guy, he's a real coward. I know, but when you need him, he's just not there. Hi, we're here. Hi. 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 Thanks for coming. You got the instructions straight? Oh, sure, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure. Just, just stay calm. Sure, sure. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. Right. <laughs> Why are you here? Oh, I came to meet a friend. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And you? Yeah, oh, same as you. Oh, I see. Excuse me. Don't go. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Strange, you didn't come. Let's go. Right, yeah, right. Let's go. Damn it. Oh, bastard. Didn't come. Uh, uh, uh. It's Kibble Dango. He brought men and swept the station. Huh. That old bastard. And so he's going to actively oppose me now, is he? Damn him. That old fool is just digging his own grave. Okay, Marla. Yeah. Bye. Bye. Good night. <laughs> Why shouldn't I come back? You're home. Your ma's dead. Your girl's married. What's more, Sung is determined to get you. And I want him. I've been three years in jail. My ma? It was this business that killed her. Nothing I could do. I shall get even with him. Tell me how. 
He's the most powerful man around here. What can you do? These of your friends would help you out. What could they do? Me. I'm just a cripple. Uncle. Don't worry. I'll think of something. I'd like to see my mother's grave. Brother Ma, Linku left this with me. It's for you. And she asked me to see you got it. She said, I want she had to marry some son. That's enough. Farm Road. Which house? Songs. What for? Want to see Sung Ting Wei? I hear he needs men. He's only hiring killers. <laughs> that suits me. <laughs> You're a young guy, but pretty strong. Why don't you go and get a job on a farm? No future. You think there's a future with Sung? You're wrong. My friend, that's my business. Now either tell me. Or I'll ask elsewhere. Straight on. Turn left, then right. And the last house belongs to Song. May I ask your name? No need. Anyone who works for Song is my enemy. We shall meet again. your uncle. He told us you'd be here. Here we are. Hey, listen, you're something. When Sung knows you're back, 
he's gonna blow his pop. Power thing. We eat and we sleep. And apart from being pushed around by old souls, things are fine. I'll fix you. Don't worry. Hey, now look. Don't want to depress you. When you left here, something way ran this place. But now, things are worse. He's developed and become stronger. Nobody can touch him, not even you. It's no use. I've made plans. I'll get him. I swear I will. Hey, listen. David. I won't involve you. It's my affair. No matter what, I'll do it. Hey, what do you mean? If you're going to act, then we're going with you. Really? Of course. <laughs> and me too. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, <laughs> there he is. Hey, what the hell have you been out in the bushes for, huh? When I came, Sao Chu was here. He was talking to her. Didn't want to interrupt, so I lay down in the grass. <laughs> Next thing, I fell asleep. Just woke up. <laughs> Hey, Bob. Guy to see you. Bring him in. Bring him in. Right. See? You, Mr. Sung? How can I help you? Need a job. Oh. Do you? Your name? Chao Sung. That's my full name. Chao Sung. Hmm. Good short name. What do you do? Everything. <laughs> Except anything on it. On it! Very good. Can you shoot? You may as well ask a bird whether it flies. Good. You're well qualified. I can use you. All right. Name your price. Hmm? My price? I should assume you'll want some pay. <laughs> Not really. As long as I can eat. But still, one condition. Well, I only obey you. Of course. And all the rest obey me. I see. But they'll only obey you if you can prove you deserve it. <laughs> Jasa, I'll put you in charge of the casino. You can live there. There's food and drink. And girls, too, if you want. But still, I shall hold you responsible for everything there. Hmm. All right. Go and have a bath. Change your clothes. What's your name? Well, son. And you? You, Jack. Mm. Go run a bath for me. You're about my size. Lend me a suit and a pair of shoes. And I don't like housemaids. So from today, you two men can serve me. Huh? <laughs> 
Hurry up and fix my thigh. And not too hot. Or else I shall kick your teeth in. Yes, sir. Good. I like to see a man like you. I need someone like you to run this place. Right! Table wins at this time, Bob! Oh. All right! Please give it! Please, please give it now! Come on, you can bet! Come on, you can win! Come on! If you don't bet, you're never gonna get rich! Please give it now! Come on! Come on! <laughs> <laughs> hey, now place your bet. Here's your chance to win, Bob. You never know, this may be a lucky night to win yourself a fortune right here. <laughs> Come on, Nancy, place your bet. And place your bet. That. Get your bets down. Not much time left now. Now hurry up there, folks. Hey, come on. Place your bets. Come on. Hurry your luck. The more you bet, the more you win. Place your bets. All right? Right? Right! High win. Pay on high. Table pays on high. Come on. <laughs> Last chance now, place your bet, gentlemen. Last chance. There we go. Come on, come on. Could be a lucky night. Place your bet. Come on, last chance. Uh, yes, yes. Okay, that's enough. Ah. Uh, ha! There we are. See you, sir. Just a lucky night. That's for today, for your kind advice. But now I've paid you back, I think you should leave. If I were you, I wouldn't stay around you. You ought to be in the city. You just don't belong here. You could do much better than this. The job suits me. <laughs> Rigging, cheating, is that what you like? If you were anyone else, I'd knock your head off. Why not try? You came looking for trouble. You're smart. <laughs> this is only my first night here. Take it easy. You want trouble? Well, come back tomorrow. You can bet I will. This place will see lots of me. time to make some. Mm. Now listen. I have one rule that I always follow in any business. Never bother the customers. Listen, this man is an enemy of the bosses.
Linku. Mara's back. But still, that guy Chow let him go. Although, he married me. He really wanted him. Well, that right? There's nothing to say. I have married you. Hmm. Well, he won't be here too long. My father will fix him. Hey? <laughs> Master Sol. Where's Chow? Uh, upstairs. Oh, sir. Son. Chow, sir. Why did you let Mark go? He was a customer. And I never bother customers. Didn't you know that he was my enemy? No. <laughs> Why, no. I didn't know. You didn't? My men told you that. Why'd you let him go? But so, you told me. I'm responsible for everything here. If I'd stopped it, it would have been a big fight. Furniture broken, all the customers gone, and a big loss of profits to show for it. And so what? That doesn't matter. I want him. At any cost. Uh oh. He's worth that much? Listen, you fool. The next time, you just kill him. Those are my orders. So, if you like, I can get him back here. You could get him. <laughs> There's nothing I can't do. But still, by the condition. Well, everyone else has to back off. I'll get him in my own way in my own time. Hello. Say three days. Right. I'll wait. Mr. Song, I don't really trust that child. You know nothing about him, and yet you keep him on. It's very risky. He came same time as Ma, same day. Perhaps he's in with Ma. You wouldn't know. Well, all right. What do you think? I know how to test him. Give him a job to do. He promised you that he'd bring Ma in for you. Now you tell him that you want Mark killed. What do you think? Right. Dad, let's do that. That's the song. Master. Promised me that you'd get my here in three days, you remember? I do. Good. But if you should fail to keep that promise, though, do you know the consequences? Hmm. I always do what I say. If you don't believe me, then just forget it. Then you can go! Right? But still, you ought to think it over. With me, you've one more friend. Without another enemy. Kid, be very careful. Because if you go near that gun, you're a dead man. <laughs> you really are fast, huh? Yeah. <laughs> 
Shanghai, why are you still here? Take those two fools and get out of here. You're out class. Let's go. Now let's talk frankly. You didn't come here just to look for a job. Not really. Mainly for other things. Oh. Right. Now let's talk about Ma. Some years ago now, he made trouble for me. So I had him sent to jail for three years on framed up charges. After he'd gone, his mother died. Then his girlfriend, Lin Ku, she married my son. And so he hates me. With reason. Right? With reason. And now, what's happened? He's back. And what does he want? Revenge. Right. You or I would want to save. Now then, I ask you to help me. To kill him. What do you say? <laughs> you refuse me. <laughs> but Sung, I don't think you understand what kind of man I am. There's one thing that I won't do for anybody. And that is to kill for money. Oh? So if you really do want me to kill this man, it'll be on my terms. Name them. Tell your men that they're to keep well away from him. And why? As he wants revenge, he'll be coming here. That's for sure. Let him come of his own free will and let him find me. Let him offend me. And in public. And when he does that, then I can kill him. And in a case like that, I'm justified. That makes sense to you, then? Right. That's a deal, then. There's one thing that's not clear. This guy, Chow, what's he up to? The only thing that matters is that he's lucky to stop. That makes him your fault. No. you. Yeah. Answer. Mm. And you. You hide. Mm. Ah, it's all right. Listen, Mr. Song has asked me to tell you. But he bears no grudge against Ma. He's willing to forget the past. If Ma's willing to do the same. Oh? Hmm. <laughs> right. Goodbye. Goodbye. Let's go. There's something fishy about this. Huh. It's simply a trick to get Ma out in the open. Well, I don't care. Trick or not, I want a showdown. You can't. You can't be so rash. Then how long should I keep hiding? Listen. Chow's kicking technique is good. Same style as yours. You like to try him out? Sure I would. I must know about his background. So then, just take it. Oh,
Your leg come full is superb. Who's your teacher? Huh. You go to hell! you here? Meet a friend. Who? Name's Chow. Chow So? Mm -hmm. How'd you know him? Ah, never mind. Come, let's have a drink. <laughs> right. And so you're flying leg. And Mars, your good friend. Right. Well, then you ought to know where he is now. He's in jail. Isn't that where you put him? When you framed him? <laughs> Flying leg. Your legs must be worth quite a lot to you. Would be a real pity if you lost them. Hmm? Hmm. Hope it won't come to that. Hmm? Now then, perhaps you'll tell me where I can find Ma. I don't... Then you leave me no choice except to cut off your legs! That's Chow. Flying leg. I'll ask once more. Where is Ma? Cut off his legs! Mm. Hold it. What's this? Oh. What's this? He belongs to me. I mean, this bastard kicked me tonight. I mean to show him some real leg kung fu.
Well? No. Hey, and you? Not a thing. And covered his tracks extremely well. I found nothing so far. Hmm. Hey, how come you know Ma? Knew me, Jill. Nice guy. Good friend. Forget him. Still, though, Song wants to have him killed. And I should do it. It's a problem. This Ma's determined to get Song. You think I should tell him about us? We could. That would give us one more man. Be useful. No. He's too impulsive. Might do something. Below the whole thing. Say nothing. He let him go? He did? You were right. No use keeping him. Time to clear this mess up. You can start with that cripple. Sure. I know Ma relies on him. I'll send a bunch of men around to his place. Now, Ma. Too many would be noticeable. And I want to keep up the numbers back here, too. Well, just send two men. Give them orders to fix that crippled bastard's other leg. And grab that girl, too. That'll bring him out. Mr. Sung's men, we have a question. Where's Ma now? I don't know. Listen, if I were you, I would talk. Although I don't like trouble, it doesn't scare me. Oh! <laughs> 
dumped in some ditch. Yeah! 
Don't go. Be patient. We've been patient enough. <laughs> Going there now will do no good. Just mess things up. You're just afraid you'll lose your job. Damn it. I've had enough of you. <laughs> Works around the clock. It's already nearly fifteen hundred pounds. Good. Dutchy, that use the new route for this one and make sure reach Mr. Fogg on time. Sir. Had news. Someone has been sent here to investigate you. How can they know about me? Hmm. Guess they discovered your connection with Mr. Fung. Oh. Mr. Fung said to alert you. And you're to stop business here for a while. Also, be careful of strangers. All right. 
I'll go. I'll see you soon. Hmm. Goodbye. See you. Mr. Wah? Please. Liar. Sir? Yes, sir. Get Chow Sung over here. Sir. Now wait. Tell nobody. Where are you from? Push off. Get lost. Great, I can. The game is over now. <laughs> Tell me who sent you. Who's your boss? Time we had a very frank talk. Do you? Mm. Well, what do you want to talk about? Listen, I'm not stupid. And while I can tell you're not a millionaire, you don't have to be a wandering gambler either. That's for sure. Let me ask you, what's your real purpose in coming here? Mr. Sun, it's hard to answer that question. 
What's more, I don't want to. But if you doubt me, though, I shall leave. Oh, no. You shall answer first. And what if I don't? Then you'll be killed. You sure that you could? It's my house. Well, don't depend on your men too much. Don't think they could manage that. So you refuse to answer? I do admire your calmness. You're a very tough man. But you must know that if I really decided to kill you, there isn't much you could do. I know you intend to kill me. You do? Of course. But I also know that you're going to change your mind. And why? Somebody won't let you. Who? The boss. Which boss? Why, your boss, Mr. Fong. Just who are you? Well, now, he'll be here very soon. Ask him to tell you. Oh. If that's all, I'll be going. Barrett, did you believe all that? Did you? I didn't believe a word of it. Have him follow. I'll go. Well, we still don't have any evidence. When war arrives, they'll know about us. And they'll also realize we're onto them. So we'll have to move quickly now. But it's too late to tell Senshun. And that only leaves the two of us. But still, we have to risk it. You better go and inform Ma. He should go to Sung's place as soon as he can. And you? I'm still not sure who I am yet. I'll try and fix something up. And I'll be there when you make your move. Right. I'll go and see Ma. Hold it! Don't move! Hold it! Now, Sung, what do you say now? <laughs> I would say, you're not too smart. Don't try any tricks. I don't need tricks. Now that you've decided to move in and lend me a hand. Just what do you mean? <laughs> well, that's what I meant just now. You see? Well, great. Get moving. It'll be easy now. Right. Go on, hurry. Now then, we'll see your dad. Master! Master! Big trouble! Big trouble! Tell them got your son! What? So, your son followed me, got caught, and so saved me a lot of trouble. Let him go! Not so easy. Now tell me where your opium processing plant is. I don't know what you mean. I'll tell you. You and Fung are partners. You produce and he sells. You really thought the police didn't know? <laughs> we know the whole damn thing. No idea what you mean. Didn't War Chi visit you yesterday? Well, he's since talked to me. I know everything, you see. God damn it! I'll kill you! I die. So does your son. I could give him up. Sir! Mr. Tong, you really would kill him? I must get rid of you. No matter what it costs. God damn you! Sir!
Revenge is a personal thing. It's the law that counts. <coughs> now then, collect their guns and lock them in the cellar. I'm going along with Song to the plant. Wait in the casino. <sighs> Tell them to stop working now. They have just 30 minutes. Clear everything up here. Listen, those Mr. Sung's orders? Well, of course they are. Who else is? Hmm? Got you now. And the evidence. So you're here. You really have bad luck. I arrived just in time. I'm sorry. But all your plans are washed up now. I knew that something had gone wrong here. I came at once. Listen, there's a man called Ma. He's working with Chow. He's at the casino. We'll have to get him, too. Oh? Ma can fight pretty good. But still, his character is more dangerous than his skill. Why am me? Never gives up. Haji. You can look after Mr. Sung for a while here. I'll be back. After I dealt with Ma. Hey, Ma. 
There's somebody coming. One summer? Chow You are? I'm his friend. Old friend. Not here. Oh, you. Thanks now. What's your name? Afraid hmm. I can't tell you that. Hmm? Tell me. What's going on? Seems something happened here. Can't tell you. That's up to you. But still, now I'm here. Things are going to change. Now, come on. Just relax. We're all Charles' friends here. I'm sure this is a problem. That fella, don't trust him. Hey, Charles never mentioned him. I don't know who he is. We'll wait till Chow gets back. And if he doesn't? Think something's happened? Hmm. If he doesn't come back, I'm sure the guy's involved. <laughs> because he posed as Chow's friend knowing he wouldn't come back. All right, I'll go and check. By yourself? <laughs> It's all right. And while you're waiting here, you watch that guy. Hmm? Why doesn't Chow come? Hold it. It's the mouth word. Nobody's to leave here until he gets back. I mean me? Right. What if I insist? There's me. And three others. We'll handle you. So you stay here. Hey! What's wrong? Hey! You man! Hey! hey. Come on over here! What's wrong? Hey! He seemed quite all right. Then he passed out. Hey! Come on! Let's get a hold of him. Take his head. Use his leg. Careful. Careful. You mustn't drop it. I'll get a doctor. Yeah. Come on. Charles is looking processing back. He wants you there. Because of you, I killed my only son, but now I've got you here. I promise, I'm going to make you suffer. I was careless. I knew that there was something wrong. I should never have kept you on. But your main danger, though, isn't me. You. Sorry, Mr. Thong. Only three men know this place. That's you, me, Mr. Thong. Now it's discovered. Mr. Thong told me to destroy the place and anybody who might talk, including you.
thought he. I always paid you well. Oh. Mr. Fung paid me more. God damn it! You were his man? <laughs> you bastard, you! You shut your mouth! Or I'll kill you now! Let's go.
Won't give up. Well, I think that. Kung Fu is good, but he can't stop bullets. Right, Ma. Go on. Tie him up. Revenge 
doesn't really count. The law is what really matters. Tarzan! Tarzan!